It's 12 o'clock basically. It's around the town. <laughs> it's 11 53, 7 minutes to 12. And so, yeah, I have my reunion today. Sorry. I have my reunion today. And yeah, I'm here so early. It starts at 2 30. I'm here so early because my mommy goes to St. Elizabeth on Saturday, so she can't really pick drop me off at regular time but she does a farmer's market at hope gardens every saturday so i either had to wake up at eight o'clock and come down here i came down here at 10 o'clock though so it really wasn't i thought i would come here by nine o'clock but no came here at 10 o'clock and so yeah i'm just hanging out with vanessa hold on a second but yeah as i was saying so on um, hang out with my mommy worker Vanessa. So that was the only way I could come or is that not come and like I really wanted to come because this may be the last time I ever see them again in my life. So so I really wanted to come. So I was talking about this like, I really want to come so I know at the time I wasn't gonna miss it, especially because I had an opportunity to come. But yeah. So basically that's what I'm doing. I'm gonna vlog you. I'm gonna try my best to vlog it. Like I'm gonna try and be bold and <laughs> vlog it in front of these strangers. Yeah. But look at my hair. I love it. I like the bottle in it if this colour is funny. But like I love it. I don't hate that. I love it. I was reading my book Becoming by Michelle Obama and it ends with us. It ends with us is just too emotional for me. I can't. I read it already. I was trying to reread it, but I can't. It's too emotional for me. And so, yeah, that's what I've been doing. I'm just. Okay. Story time. I was just like talking about it a while ago in that clip about oh, how we pick the whole garden because I did that and this small and the middle of the one house blah 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 whatever i was saying i decided to say okay let me check the group chat to make everything still going right and i checked the chat and then switch the thing i said devon house oh it's better to go to devon house because they have more food options and whole garden is just too open and see I'm gonna call somebody to come and pick me up now. Because of what? And my mother just called me telling me that oh Aunt Vita Gay's going to my pick me up what time will I be ready? And then I just go and check to make sure everything is still I can't go to this reunion. I I won't be seeing these people for the rest of my life, you know? I'm positive about that and won't be going to Devon House. What an inconvenience. Like, seriously. Yeah, I'm just here I'm still Okay, let me tell you the story time I hold got there. So like 
I thought it was hope garden. Right, my mother has this farmer's market at hope gardens. So I was like, okay, this will be easy. I just have to wake up early and go there. So I woke up at eight o'clock and she took me there at ten o'clock. At ten o'clock at hope gardens, right? Sitting and just waiting for for them at the farmers market. Right, waiting, waiting, filming my TikToks, waiting for them, waiting for two o'clock when everybody gonna come. And then they switch up the place on me and say they one house. I was like, wait, what? No, I'm not going again. This was so rude. Like last minute, last minute they switch it up. They switch it up. I was like, hell no, I don't want to go to it. And I just changed my mind because I'm like, I'm like, I'm never gonna see these people again, right? I was just upset because like they keep switching up the pace and like canceling it and then uh, nobody's going. So I was like, no, move, I'm not going to this. And like, when am I ever going to see these people again in my life? So like, I'm like, okay, I'll go. Okay. And then I let my, my godmother took me um from home gardens to the one house. And she's just like down the street. It's a long street, but it's on the same road, right? So I went and I was there for mas- by myself for a while because I went at like one forty and the time they said was what, 2 o'clock. So Elia, one of the girls, she came at 2 o'clock and I started I'm like, oh hi. I was asking her questions about her. Like, it was real key awkward because like, I was asking her questions, trying to like, you know, start a conversation. Other people came. Some other people came and like she just went off to them and I was just tagging along and then Coinsola was texting and she was like, oh my god, I don't know if I should go. I'm not, it's going to be kind of awkward because I don't really know anybody. Like Coinsola, you better come because, you better come because I'm here stranded by myself that I cannot really be engaged in the conversation. I was trying my best to be as social as possible people. Like, oh my god i was trying my best to be as social as possible it was working because i just wasn't like you know people go off into clicks that's what happened and i wasn't in the click i was just like you know when people are talking that's work and you're just there the observer that's how i would say it was really awkward but then coming said i came thank god for her i have to say thank you to her because it would have been hard when she was in there because john mark came i talk about john mark a good amount John Mark came, but he is like that guy to get engaged in the, everybody's conversation. So I was kind of like stranded. I was like talking to him a little bit. When Quentin came, I kind of opened up. And like, well, like Quentin and I were low key, like awkward. But we're talking with the two boys that were the John Mark and Mark Anthony. We're talking with them a lot. I thought for that, that everybody would be like, you know, asking everybody and they'd be like, join, but like, not really. People just went off into their own like friends that they used to know so it was like mm. and like everybody didn't come like barely a quarter of people came so reunion <laughs> like not even 20 people came it was a good amount to say it was like a reunion but not a lot of people came still like, yeah if my friends that i used to know like john marie came i would be like way more engaged and like would be like talking and asking like, how have you been you know when you like meet up with an old friend i saw a thing like she would have been there she wasn't there but like, i'm just saying that's how reunion should be but it was a little bit awkward because i feel i just it wasn't a lot of the people that i was really friends friends with so that, yeah but overall like me and Quinta were just talking and first time and we're like being awkward like apart from the group together so in unison so i had a good time because Quinta was there and like and I, when we talked to john mark and jana was there yeah i talked to jana so i think you know i act low-key felt awkward but i felt so content it was funny and like, even when i was there and i was like kind of by myself in the that not being really engaged in the conversation. I, I felt content. That's growing up, people. That's growing up. I didn't feel like left out. I was left out, but I, I didn't like feel a way about it. Overall, it was a nice little reunion because I hadn't seen Quintella in a while. Like, I haven't seen her in like three years. So it was nice to see her. And yeah, it was nice to see Jana and John Mark. And Elia actually, Elia was nice. She was engaged, and yeah, Mark Anthony was there. He was so different. He has that 
like he looks so different nobody could recognize it and he said can i actually look at him for like five seconds because he said hi to me i was like i look at him like mark i was so so confused i wish more people would have been there you know because i like, have a list of people who I actually wanted to see like really bad they weren't in the group though it was nice it wasn't awful but like the story of how i really how, how i got there was just a whole headache because yeah and then coming back i took a taxi home and i'm safe in my room like i prayed so much on that taxi because like, i wouldn't come out to get kidnapped <laughs> Anyways, thank you so much for watching that like, comment subscribe for more summer madness stories. I was going to vlog it, but like when I tell you, it was so awkward. It was so awkward. I couldn't vlog. But like Crystal, I was like doing a little vlogging for me. Like, I was low-key embarrassed. She's like, oh, go guys. You don't want to be on my name's YouTube. And I was like, don't talk about my YouTube to these people. Anyways, I hope none of them watch this. <laughs> but I won't continue to watch it because it was only good things I had to say about her. But like soon, thank you so much for watching. Like, comment, subscribe for more summer madness. Comment down below if you want more story time, John. Because trust me, great six of them I have too much stories to tell. I'm going out with my friend next week. See you then. So yeah. Natural, can't deny it, it's just factual I'm the question